um, what should I say? Check right now. Check? Like okay. that? Check? Yep. Just so that I can sync up the audio okay. and video. All right, Go ahead. check. Hi there, and welcome to Story Center. Um, this, uh, Chris is, this is Chris. My name's Chris. Um, and we're going to talk about my, my first day at Wald, Walden, no, no, it's, uh, this was, um, geez, uh, can we start over again? <sighs> okay. My first day at, uh, downtown books and coffee. Um, yeah, uh, what was, all right. Um, okay. Yeah. I'm okay. I'm on the sales floor. Um, and I'm, I'm going to try and make a sale. And um, there's a there's a customer that you can see. I'm, I'm going over to the customer. And I'm... You can do this. Um, oh, oh, okay. And, um, okay, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking of a book. You can see there. I'm, um, okay, Terry Pratchett looks good. Um, I'm, I'm making the pass. Um... Boom goes the dynamite. Hello, uh, welcome to another Just a Suggestion. This is Chris, and uh, my pick this week is a fascinating book um, called Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children and that of course is by Ransom Riggs and now this is a book for young adults and I'd heard great things about this book um, one of the things that I thought was interesting about the book is that it's filled with pictures and in the book there are pictures that the, the main character finds and whenever you find them in the book they are actually in the book Anyway, um, and the picture on the cover is one of the pictures. The picture on the back as well. Um, little girl floating in, in midair. Um, so I was already expecting a, a good book, but uh, I, I got a little more than I was expecting. It turned out to be a bit darker than I thought. But right near the beginning, the, the main character mentioned something about how something happened in his life that divided it into two sections, before and after. And uh, that, perhaps to me, had a particular meaning because there was something that happened, oh gosh, more than half my life ago, that I personally divided it into before and after. So I, I kind of had a kind of a little personal touch with the book there, and uh, you know, just very, very interesting story. I thought it was very creative. Um, give an idea of some of the, the monsters in this book. Um, wonderful read. I thought it was a wonderful read. And, uh, I mean, my, my joy in reading this one was discovering what happens next, just letting the story unfold. So come on down to Downtown Books and Coffee here in Auburn, New York, and uh, maybe check out Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children. Catch you later.